Race three of the weekend at Donington Park saw Tom Sykes start from pole as he was looking for his first treble in BSB. As the lights went out, all three on the front row got a good start. Brad Ray chasing down Sykes, but it was the Grinner who got into turn one in P1. A great start also from a few rows back from Glenn Irwin as he went round the outside. Jason Halloran went underneath Tom Sykes in the early stages, but Brad Ray then went back through on O'Halloran as they hunted down Tom Sykes with Glenn Irwin and Andy Irwin in hot pursuit. A lovely move from Brad Ray and meant he went to take the lead of the race and Glenn Irwin followed going through on the number 66. These three managed to peel away from the rest of the pack as Tom Sykes made another move on Glenn into the hairpin. Irwin challenged Sykes once more with a beautiful move around Starkeys and was closing on the leader. It was big drama though as Jason Halloran tagged the back of Tom Sykes, barrel rolling through the gravel and having to be stretched away. That would end Sykes' chances. Glenn Irwin was leading, but Brad Ray was challenging, and the two Synetic BMWs were just behind as well in Andy Irwin and Danny Buchan. And Tommy Bridewell was making great progress as well. But a big moment for Glenn Irwin as he made his way through Foggy S's, snapping his right foot peg on the exit right here. And ordinarily, you would think that would be the end of anyone's race, but he kept on plugging away. He struggled through the Melbourne loop just after that happened. Brad Ray and his brother Andy Irwin going through on him. And Tommy Bridewell had a bit of a nibble late on as well. But Glenn Irwin fought on despite not having that foot peg. And in the closing stages, managed to hold on to a heroic third place. It was second for his brother Andy, but Brad Way continues his absolute romp of the season. His ninth win of the championship and 66-point lead going into the final round at Brass.